John, I want to get your take on some other important news this morning concerning Robert Levinson, of course, the American who disappeared in Iran when he was visiting there in 2007. We know the Associated Press has reported that he was on a CIA mission at the time. And I understand now CBS News spoke with this shadowy figure that met with Levinson. Who is this guy? What have we learned? So David Salyudin is an individual who's wanted for murder in the United States. It's a murder that occurred in 1980. It was a, an assassination in Maryland of a former Iranian official. He fled to Iran and has been living there out of reach of the United States for years. That was the person that Levinson was going to meet on Kish Island. And when we spoke to Salyudin again yesterday, and, and he's somebody we've been in contact with over the last couple of years, Pat Milton from our investigative unit said, what happened that day? And he described meeting Levinson, having dinner, walking on the beach, sitting on a rock, talking together. And at some point he said, Iranian security officials, um, he says he believes they were Iranian security officials, came, separated them, took him for identification, took Levinson away, and then he never saw him again. Why is that significant? Because yesterday we had the foreign minister on saying, well, the government has no idea where he was and we didn't take him. And you have uh, the former president of Iran acknowledging that there had been some negotiations about this. He told you in an interview uh, that you both did together uh, last year that um, he thought that this deal had all been worked out between our intelligence agencies. So that's an indicator. I have been told by people, both Iranian sources and U.S. sources, that at different times there have been negotiations behind the scenes to arrange a trade for Levinson, and for different reasons they fell through. So, so they do know where he is. I'm it, it seems we have two storylines here, Nora. One is the public storyline. We don't know where he, where he is. After which the Iranian foreign minister smiled um, knowingly. And, and the sub rosa one, which is there's a lot going on in terms of discussions about getting him back. Does the U.S. government believe he's alive? They have no proof of life that shows them that. Okay. All right. John, thanks.